Hey Star Wars fans and Black Series action figure collectors, welcome back to another bit of an overview more so than a review because I decided I'm not going to actually open this one, I'm not going to take it out of the box. Uh, big thanks to Darth Paul on Instagram, um, that's P-O-O-L-E, go and give him a follow, he's a fellow Australian, he is based over in Western Australia and uh, he hooked me up with this uh, 50th anniversary of Lucasfilm, 6 inch... Uh, Boba Fett based on his animated debut. Well, not really, because it's from Droid, so technically not. But still the same style. Um, and this is... The packaging is really cool. Which is why I want to keep this one in a box. Um, I just really like the artwork on it. I think that's really cool. Uh, particularly with the uh, hype of Boba Fett at the moment, given the Book of Boba Fett has just finished. So this is cool. We've got R23PO Vlix. And Boba on the back of the box. The very cool Star Wars droids. The adventures of R2-D2 and C-3PO on the side there. That's really nice. Now, yeah, like he, he gave it... He, he let me um, grab it for a reasonable price. Just he wasn't happy that it was a... As a carded collector, you know, be disappointed if you come with a slice on the box. Um, you know, it's just people using box cutters and, and not being super careful, but um, yeah, so but that something like that doesn't really bother me. Um, I'll hopefully get a nice sort of acrylic box that I can display this open um, because, yeah, they've used the uh, little Velcro tabs at the top again, which is cool. So here we have the figure. And, uh, yeah, it's it's basically just a repaint of the Empire Strikes Back Boba Fett from 2014. There's a little write-up on the inside here in uh, multiple languages. It says, with his customised Mandalorian armour, deadly weaponry and silent demeanour, Boba Fett was one of the most feared bounty hunters in the galaxy. And now we get over to the figure here. We have Boba Fett, obviously, writ written there. The droids logo again. And we get this really cool coloured looking boba. Now, I was remiss. I probably wouldn't have picked this one up if uh, he hadn't offered it to me. Because just, I don't know, it just wasn't really my cup of tea. But to have it in hand now is just, it, it's a cool, really cool piece. And I'm really excited to have this, particularly part of my Boba Fett display when I eventually... Um, get a Star Wars room set up again at some point. Um, everything is in crates now, and it makes me sad. But um, yeah, I will, I will, I will return and agree to numbers because um, I am going to buy stuff in between. Um, but yeah, I do lament the fact that they uh, decided not to go with the with the sort of the pulse rifle that Mandalorian was based off of um, as his weapon that he had on the big dinosaur back in the holiday special. I think that would have been really cool, but uh, I like the colour palette they've used for the for the figure, the sort of light blues and the sort of mustard yellow. I think it looks really good. Um, yeah, same with the cream of the jetpack. Uh, with the weapons, you know, they're just a plain grey, so not much going on there. There is a little bit of silver on the tip of the pistol. Or is there? No, it's just light reflecting. So yeah, I thought there might have been a little bit of paint detail there, but no, not to be this time. Um, but you know, it's Boba Fett. He's pretty badass. Looks good in the packaging, um, even though it is that repainted Boba Fett, even though we've got a far superior version in the Return of the Jedi version that came out last year. Um, you know, surely this one's going to die soon. <laughs> surely. But, uh, yeah, there's all the, all the barcode. Is that if you're interested? I'm not sure if that helps anyone or not. But, yeah, all the mumbo-jumbo. There's all the legal garbage. You know, don't give it to children. Do you reckon? <laughs> but that is that. I thought I'd just put together this short video. I did say last week that I'd get it together and... Uh, yeah, here it is. I hope you've enjoyed it. Thank you very much for tuning in and sticking around. Please give the video a thumbs up. Hit subscribe if you're new around here. And I will see you all on the next video. Until then, may the force be with you. Always.